Welcome to iCarly. No, I'm sure. Hey, what is up, guys? I'm Pokemon TCG here, and today, guys, I've got another deck profile for you. We're gonna be taking a look at Superior, a fun deck. If you guys missed it, I did cover Meowth Bats, so make sure to go check that out. So, we're gonna go ahead and get into it. This is a very straightforward, a straightforward list that I've been working with, and two cards that I definitely would recommend putting in here uh, is Revitalizer from Generations and the Promo Jirachi that gets rid of the special energy. I don't have it in here because I couldn't find it. Revitalizer isn't good. You're not good. You're playing. You played Jolteon, shut up. Shut up. <laughs> totally All right, good. so starting off, not against this. So starting off with this, we have Superior. I'm going to be playing a 4-4-4 line, and I'll go ahead and get to these here in a second. But here they are. So Superior has two attacks. Both of them take one energy. Uh, Coil does 40 damage, and then during your next turn, any uh, attacks that Superior does do 60 more damage. And then it has Slashing Strike for 80, and then you can't use Slashing Strike during your next turn. So pretty much like the idea around this is to do Coil, and then pretty much what that'll do is that'll make Slashing Strike hit for a lot of damage. And pretty much like this just hits really hard for the hold of nothing, and it's very fast to get out. And one of the cool things about this is we do play four Forest of Giant Plants, so it's very easy to get that out too. So you can play Servine. What that does is whenever you evolve in from uh, Snivy into Servine, it paralyzes. Yeah, you, know, you have to flip a coin if it paralyzes. So that's a, it's probably really loud here. I hope you guys can hear me. But um, pretty much it'll paralyze it, so that, you know they have to have a switch or an AZ or something like that to get out of the active spot. So pretty much what you can do is you can um, play Force of Giant Plants, paralyze, and then start attacking. But we do have something in here to try to help out a little bit with damage, and that is going to be a 2-2 Aria Dose. Aria's Dose is in here pretty much for poisonous nets, and what that does is you poison uh, both active Pokemon if they're not grass, they're not poison, but uh, that's just in here to kind of increase the damage a little bit. And so that's pretty good. Uh, for a secondary backup attacker, I went ahead and decided to put in a mill tank. It has powerful friends. If you have a stage two on your bench, pretty much what that does is it does 80 damage. And I figured mill tank would just be a cool secondary attacker. I definitely would recommend putting in Jirachi. Next up, we have a Dedenne. Uh I just put Dedenne in here really for entrainment, just to get something, uh, get a couple uh, Snivy on the bench. And so that's pretty much it. That's in here for uh, you. Can also use any. Energy short against Evatol or something that's weak to uh, pretty much a mini Mewtwo. That's, that's true. And we have two Shaman. This one's totally real. This is not a printed out picture of a Shaman. Would do again. Um, but we have two Shaman pretty much in here for consistency. The reason why I'm playing a printed out Shaman picture is because I only own three and the other two in my other deck. All right, so that's gonna do it for the Pokemon. Next up, we're gonna take a look at the supporters here. So we have four Sycamore, three N, one AZ, and one Lysander. Uh, I would like to have two Lysander in here, but I've just been kind of monkeying with the numbers and everything, trying to find a list that I like, and I figured this would be a good starting point uh, for people who are wanting to try this deck out, so very, very um, self-explanatory. Uh, the reason why I run AZ is because of the fact that maybe you can chain two slashing strikes back to back, or if you have a heavily damaged uh, superior, you can just pick it up, and broken top, or broken mind space it back down, or force a giant plants. So that's why that's in here. For trainers, we've got four VS Seeker just to get back your supporters. We have three trainers now. This is in here just to hunt out your uh, trainer, item, supporter, or whatever. And then we have three muscle band. This is in here just to hit a little harder. And then we play three level ball. Level ball is in here so you can search out your Sermons, your Snivies, and that way you can just try to get them out. Pretty much this deck all about getting uh, Superior out as fast as possible. Next up we play three Ultra Ball. Uh, I, don't, I don't know how I feel about the three Ultra Ball. I'm just kind of going back and forth with it, but just really in here to search out stuff. Uh, mostly uh, superior. You don't really have a clear-cut way to get superior to your hand, so I'm just kind of been working with Ultra Ball. Also, I can grab a Shaman. Uh, play one Switch. Uh, usually, just have a switching card. It's good. You can play Escape Rope if you feel more comfortable with that. Uh, play Super Rod and Sacred Ash. I'm trying to see which one I like better. It's good to try to shuffle in your superior line back in, and I figure the Super Rod would be good. That way, you can shuffle your energy back in too. Puzzle of time. And then we play uh, four Forest of Giant Plants. This is pretty much in here, so that way you can just immediately go Snivy, Servine, and then Superior just right off the bat. So four of those is in here, plus it really helps you have a counter stadium and win the stadium war, and it's just a little more consistent. Unless you open with three of them in a, a second war, then you're going to hate your life. But uh, for energy... 
One, two, yeah. three, uh, four, five, five, six, seven. Yeah, we run eight energy, uh, eight grass. You don't really need any other type of energy except for grass, so that's why they're here. But uh, this is a pretty straightforward list, pretty self-explanatory. It's very easy to play. It's very fun, too. I love this deck. I love playing it. So if you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to like it and subscribe if you haven't done that already. And there will be an end card at the end of the video. You guys can go watch my Meowth de uh, Bats deck profile, or you can go watch Steam Deck Thursday. So if you guys enjoyed it, make sure to like it. Take care, and this is Epic Pokemon TCG signing out. Take care, guys. Some things are permanent